हेलो एंड वेलकम टू दिस सेशन इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन एंड द क्वेश्चन सेज दैट लीजा रिसीव्ड हर बैंक स्टेटमेंट डेटेड जून 20 फॉर हर चेकिंग अकाउंट शी आल्सो मेंटेन्ड हर चेक रजिस्टर शी कंपेयर्ड हर बैलेंस मेंशनड इन द बैंक स्टेटमेंट विद हर चेक रजिस्टर and she found the difference in both amounts reconcile her checking account you are given her bank statement and check register now this is her bank statement and here is the check register now let us start with the solution of the given question we are given the check register maintained by lisa and her bank statement now according to lisa's checking register she should have a balance of 1580.17 dollars in her checking account and according to the bank statement she has 1204.67 dollars in her account now we will reconcile her bank statement so that balance in her bank statement matches with the balance in her check register to reconcile the bank statement we follow the following steps first of all record the balance in your check register then subtract any bank charges as shown in bank statement from your check register balance and if any interest is paid on your money by the bank as shown in the bank statement then add it to the check register balance then in bank statement add deposits recorded in your record but not shown on the statement after this subtract total check outstanding that is the checks which have not yet been cleared by the bank on which they were drawn from the bank statement balance the required balance will equal the check register balance now we reconcile lisa's checking account now first of all we record the balance in lisa's check register now here we can see that the balance in her checking register is 1580.17 dollars then we subtract any bank charges as shown in bank statement from her check register balance now we can see in the bank statement that on june 19 the bank deducted 13 dollars as bank charges from her account so from check register balance we deduct 13 dollars and we get 1580.17 dollars minus 13 dollars which is equal to 1567.17 dollars now we will consider this amount as balance on check register and will reconcile the bank statement so that the balance in the statement should also be equal to 1567.17 dollars then in bank statement add deposits recorded in her record but not shown on the statement now on comparing the bank statement and the check register we see that the check deposited on june 14 of 412 dollars amount is not mentioned in the bank statement it is because it is not yet cleared by the bank so we add this amount in the bank statement and we get 
1204.67 dollars plus 412 dollars which is equal to 1616.67 dollars then we subtract total check outstanding that is the checks which have not yet been cleared by the bank on which they were drawn from the bank statement balance now again on looking at both check register and bank statement we see that the checks numbered 202 and 203 of electricity bill and phone bill are the outstanding checks so we will deduct the amount of these two bills from the balance in the bank statement obtained in the previous step that is 1616.67 dollars and we get 1616.67 dollars minus 25 dollars minus 24.50 dollars and this is equal to 1567.17 dollars now this amount matches with the amount in the check register obtained in this step thus the amount in both check register and the bank statement now matches thus we have reconciled lisa's account this completes our session hope you enjoyed this session